If you have bought the new issue of the Kitchen Garden for January 2017, you notice there is a book inside it, and this book is called uh, Forgotten Fruits, the Stories Behind Britain's Traditional Fruit and Vegetables. Shortlisted for the Andrew Simon Book Awards 2008. It's written by Christopher Stocks. is in the uh, paperback format, so you can take it with you in the bus or train and read it during the uh, travels that you have journeys daily journeys it's in 298 useful pages as has one page more extra cover image credits and everything and uh, let us see the inside of it forgotten fruits it starts here then some praise for the forgotten book food book by others and it was originally published in 2000 uh, Eight, and now they have decided to give you give it uh, by a magazine. And this, as a content about it, is because it was about fruits. I don't buy any more books about vegetables because that's practically saturated everything. Too much. This one is about apples, beetroot, broad beans. Oh, is that some vegetables? Brussels sprout, cabbages, carrots, cauliflower, celery, cherries, cucumber, currants. Uh, gooseberry, leeks, lettuces, onions, parsley, pears, uh, peas, plums, potatoes, radishes, rhubarb, runner beans, strawberry, tomato, turnips, and sweets. And what can I do next? Organization, supplier, places to visit, gazetteer, gazetteer, yeah. Bibliography, acknowledgement, and index. And uh, this was a list of the content. You can just see for yourself what, what is in here. For example... Prize prank, prize punk, or prize pink, Clayworth prize pink, golden self blanching. These are about for celery and other things. Um, and uh, it's about potato probably. This part is about the pears and the story behind them, and then goes to introduce different varieties of pear. Black Black Worcester before 1575. Conference since 1885. Conference is a very famous variety of pear in Britain. And um, better than that is a con Concord. Green pear of the year, or year. Pitmaston Duchess, or Duchess. Hassel or Duchess, in French. Uh, William Bonchreton, Bartlett. And and this part is about apples. There's a, probably one of the biggest parts in this book, about apples. And uh, then it starts from Ashmead's Colonel and tells the dates around 1700s. And Bardsey before 1998, that's one of the new uh, apples. Uh, Bascom Mystery, Beauty of Bath. Which is part of, um, um, Irish peach is better than the beauty of a bath. Blenheim orange, Bramley seedling, Cornish gilliflower. Uh, Bramley seedling is one of the cooking apples. The original tree is yet alive but is dying because of the, the honey fungal disease. Cox orange pippin, uh, Crowley beauty, Dumlow seedling, Darcy spice. Uh, Howgate Wonder, Irish Peach, this is a better variety than the uh, Beauty of the Bath. Cassie Codlin, uh, Lane, Princess Albert, Newton Wonder, uh, Non Pareil, very old apple, Norfolk Beefing, Pitmaston Pineapple. Uh, Ripston Pippin, oh beautiful line drawings. Uh, Tompot, Worcester Perman, Tompot, I have a video about Tompot uh, from the community orchard. And uh, yeah, it goes on. It's a quite small book with a lot of information uh, in a in a compact form. So it's nice to carry it with you. When you're studying, and we want to read something in the bus or train, and for pastime, better than the fiction, <laughs> believe me. 
And that's a book. A lot of others have recommended these books, other people. So all this one, two, three, three pages are all the recommendations people have made about this. And uh, newspapers and everybody was telling us how good it is. So it was a good welcome to come with the latest issue of the Kitchen Garden magazine.